drugs, is it not? Okay, we're going to uh, we're going to begin our second uh, half of our evening. And what's nice is we, we don't have to wait for Chris to come up. He's already here, okay. so he's ready. It looks like Chris, Chris Flynn is ready to go. So um, without further ado, again, Ramblin' Chris Flynn. <laughs> So, um, when, when, uh, when Michael asked me to do this, um, there, there, were, there were two things that, that came to mind. One was, um, I think Michael Boniello has lost it because he's asking me to sing in front of people. Um, and and the, the second thing that came to mind was, what am I going to sing? Um, and, and I, I wrestled with the idea of not singing Bruce Springsteen because sing I, I think more than a few people in the room would expect me to sing Bruce Springsteen. Um, almost like I'm a gigantic Bruce Springsteen fan or something crazy like that. Well, anyway, um, I started looking outside of Springsteen's catalog and... and uh, uh, the music and, and the work of Pete Seeger has, has always really spoken to me. Um, and um, Pete Seeger turned uh, to the Bible, to the book of Ecclesiastes, um, when his record company told him that he, uh, he was writing songs, but they couldn't sell them because they were filled with too much protest. So he turned to the Bible and found protest in the Bible. Everything turn, turn, turn. There is a season turn, turn, turn. And a time to every purpose under heaven. A time to be born, a time to die, a time to plant, a time to sow, a time to kill, a time to heal, a time to have, a time. A time to rent, a time 
I hope you liked what I did there because I was turning so, my camera because um, we were saying turn, turn. One of the uh, amazing things that happened to me um, from working at the auditorium was about four or five years ago, a woman named Shelley asked me to uh, go on the road with her with Peter, Paul, and Mary. Um, and I had the, the honor of being the uh, last uh, system tour manager with Shelley uh, for Peter, Paul, and Mary. Um, um, I would sit there and, uh, during their shows in the wings and, and I'd, I'd look out onto the stage and I'd, I'd watch the three of them singing and I would just sit there and I would be absolutely dumbfounded at the fact that God had blessed me with being able to sit there and watch that, that I was being paid to do it. And I would just sit there and I would think about the, the momentous forces of change and history that their music was a part of. You know, to, to think of the power that, that they were there on the march with, on Washington with Martin Luther King, that, that they were forerunners of the civil rights movement, and just all these, these huge sweeping social changes that have happened over the past 40 years. And um, when I was talking about Michael about what order to um, do the songs in, and, um, I decided that I should close with this one. If you know it, and you probably will, please sing along. Okay. And um, I'd like to send it out to the folks from Ocean Grove uh, who are in Haiti on a mission trip. Um, and uh, we'll just ask that um, we send this song out as a prayer to them and their work. Yeah.